right, today we're gonna be doing two looks, one palette with this beautiful X file vibe giving thing. It's I can't wait to show you guys these looks. So we're gonna hop right in over to it. Okay, so I actually had this already filmed. I somehow deleted my film. Besides the beginning part. So the beginning part will be the one where I have my full face on. So I'm gonna re-show you how I did the two looks in the beginning intro. And then I'll just go through what I'm wearing in the beginning intro on my face. So we're just gonna get on with the palette here. So I don't have to redo my whole face. Hopefully I don't do it again. Ah, that's okay. But this is what we got. Okay, so I'm just gonna go in with the Essence Eye Blender Brush. And let's go with the crease. Oh yeah, I dipped into Area 51 by the way. Why did I do that? It's okay. It's okay. I was just apparently I zoned out. We're not doing that on that eye. So I'll just reprime it. I'm just having a day over here. And we're just going to see it. So I'm just going to go back in here with the back paint pot. I don't know what is wrong with me today. But we are going to get this down, okay? Good thing I can't remember what the heck I did. I spent like in. <laughs> like forever trying to download this and told me there wasn't enough room of me thinking. I had it saved. <laughs> And have his hair just to do your film to make more room. And then, well, that was a bad idea, so here I am. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go in with our lovely small shader brush here. We're gonna go into we went into tall gray here, I think. Yes. No, I did not. I went into Ghost OG. My bad. Ghost OG is where it was. I'm just gonna re go into my crease. Put a nose together. Now we're gonna take, oh, my bad. I'm just gonna retake that fluffy brush in area 51 and just I either blend it on out. I will say this gives me X file vibes. I love X files. I think it's what sold me on it. It's like yes, aliens. Yeah, all right, sign me up. Okay, so we're just gonna. I'm just trying to go in like I don't know as all the other big YouTubers say, circular motions to get that going. I'm gonna go into this Essence Smoky Eyes brush. Essence makes some good brushes, guys. We're gonna go into a black hole. I'm 
just taking it right on the inner upper corner because I don't want to lose that purple gray tone we got working on over there. I have two people I watch and they're doing um what what I hauled monthly. Would you guys be interested in seeing that? Because I buy like um older stuff that was released and um you know I don't know I find discontinued stuff or stuff that's being sold for cheap at like stores like TJ Merrick, Marshalls, you know that stuff like stuff stuff like that. I'm cut my crease but following my eyeball here. Just the shape of it. No, I'm just gonna cut that like that. die cut. That's looking so pretty. Alright, so I'm gonna pick up the uh, Elf Times J Kiss at J1. And I'm gonna go into what oh I went into where's it? Yopo. Yopo was the shade that went into. Sorry if it takes me a little bit here and I stutter a little bit I'm trying to remember what shades I went into. Oh, I'm just gonna so I'm still liking doing the two colors on this crease. Okay, I'm just gonna clean up. I need to get one of those like little color switch things where you just put your brush in there and it's clean. And we're going to probe here. I went into UFO, which is this one. God, I'm all over the place. What am I doing with my life? Oh, we're just gonna take that. Just like that. Blend. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Go back with that corner brush and the black hole. Let me tap that just to darken her up just a little bit. Okay. See them? I will just clean her up. By that, I just come in here and then I just. No, it's probably no no to do it like this, but it's okay, it works. Look at that, that already looks like 10 times better. Okay, so then eyeliner. Might as well just do it now and on camera, huh? I keep trying to do that. Okay, we're just gonna leave that side like that for now. I'll go back to that after that one and just finish it because whatever. <laughs> Gosh. I don't know. If you don't watch this, I understand. I totally understand because, you know, <laughs> I've done lost my mind over here. Okay, well that is our first done look. Now we're gonna move on to this side. And we are gonna go with this little unicorn brush. I got this at Rue 21, so if you can find it, it's real nice. So, we're gonna go to Phone Home. In her crease. That's like a fun nude pink. 
Okay, so for that we're gonna take this little other unicorn brush looking thing. I don't remember where I got this. I've had it since I've actually been doing my makeup like four or five years ago. And we're gonna go into Martian soil. We're just gonna try to meld these together. So we'll take that same brush and go back in the phone home and just go over. It's way up in my eyebrow, way up in my eyebrow. Okay, now we'll go back into Martian soil there. There we go, so now we're not losing our pink. I like how this builds up though. Alright, so now we're gonna go with another essence crease brush. I have like so many of these things. And we're gonna go into X Files. We're just gonna stay inside on the, the inner corner here. Okay, so too bad I don't have like that. So we're gonna cut that crease. Got mm -hmm. okay, so really sick and tired of seeing these uh cut creases, but you know or what I'm good at. You know, on the bright side, at least I'm still wearing the same jacket as the intro and I didn't change yet. <laughs> uh, frack myself. All right, so now where's that other one? We use the Bretman Rock for this one. We're gonna go into the shade Alien. And we're just gonna take this one in the beginning of our eye. Look how that's so pretty. And our trees. Pigment. Okay. Put a little bit more on there. Just a packet. Okay. So wipe that off and we're gonna go into Space Cowboy. So cowboy, baby. You were just saying random words and it just Remind you of a song. Hmm. Not mad at that. All right, so I'll just clean it up like I did the other side. And we'll run through the products I have on my face in the beginning. See, it always looks so much better after you clean it up. I'm 
No, you're probably saying, I want to see the inside of your eyeball. Whoa. I normally don't like to show you the inside of my eyeball, but I goofed up. I did a goof. So, I'm working with it today. Let me try to do that. My right hand on the left side, knowing I can't do it like that. At least I remembered how to do these looks. I don't really do repetitive looks, I just kind of stare at a palette for like 10 minutes and go from there. Or I'd be like, what shades have I not used? Just use those today. All right, that is, these are our finished eye looks. Okay, so now we're just gonna run over what products I have on my face in the beginning of the intro. So we'll just start with my foundation and move forward. So I have on, I use the Becca Skin Love Brighten and Blur Primer. I love this stuff. And I have the Believe Beauty Skin Finish Foundation on. And I can use this setting powder to set under my eyes because I'm trying to use it up. I'm almost there. And I went with the Maybelline New York Fit Me setting powder all over my face. And after that, I use this Peach Blur Translucent Smoothing Finishing Powder. I then dusted that all over with a fluffy brush. And I'm like, I'm like yeah, can you see it on my face? I'm not even wearing it right now. I did that. I didn't notice any difference while I was using it while filming on the footage I deleted by accident. But when I looked into the mirror, I was I did see a slight difference that looked more more without the imperfections on it is how it looked. So yeah, I'm not even mad at that. Let's stack it all right in front of me. So then for the eyeballs, I finish off my eyeballs with the uh the rock front eyeline pro this is black eyeliner i use this every week the urban decay subversion subversion slash primer and then i changed up this week went with the nars climax i've also exchanged my my um oh my nose itches i changed out my face products for a week but i did keep in the loose setting powder that compact over there, then my, I keep hitting my nose with my finger. <laughs> Kept my uh, base primer, that's it. Yes, the face primer, base primer. Okay, whatever, face, base, same thing. And the foundation stayed. So then I changed out my bronzer. We're using the NARS Laguna. I got a new blush this week, courtesy of Ross, and I'm wearing this mineral shade. I like the orangey tones. It's the only one I have like this. And then for highlight, I also picked up another sleek item. It's like three dollars and some change. I put this down first, and I went over it with this one, fully blinding. Yeah, okay. It doesn't feel like it's shut, but it's shut. Alright. Um, brows, I use the ABH Brow Definer. I like it. I don't know why I took the other end off. I'm just showing you the, um, the shape. I like that shape of brow pencils. It's my fave. And then for my lips, I had on Mistletoe. Topped with snow cone, so pretty. And I somewhat used this last week. I'm gonna keep it out and try to use it again because I bought it. I'm gonna try and use it. Um, 
okay if you if you see through my whole um i'm everywhere scattered brain in this uh video thanks for watching see you on my next one bye